I, I, you know, if you're an artist like me, you know, when you see it, you know it. And I saw it right away. Boom. Bam. I can't remember your name. What, what's your name? Elvis. Elvis Presley. My mom loved him, so that's how I got it. That's how I got the name. Yeah. Did you get hot water? I'm sorry, I don't know how I could have forgotten. Okay. No, it's okay. I, don't, I can't even remember your name. Deirdre. Deirdre, see? I didn't remember. I'm, not, I'm good with faces, but names, I mean, names I, no. yeah, I, I have a hard time. I'll say you stand. You're good right like that. All right, let me know if I got a... You don't have to do anything right so, now. So sit there and shut up. <laughs> no, keep talking, actually. Oh, yeah? You want to hear some stories? Good ones? Yeah, let me hear some stories. All right. Uh-huh. Were you telling me the story about those cops that used to drag race down at uh, Ocean Beach? Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that was my story. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I used to do 50 bucks. Oh, right. And you had 50 to bucks. off it, right? That's yeah. something, huh? Yeah. They, they, uh, they don't do it anymore. That's good. <laughs> They're supposed to be setting an example, you know? Can't be doing well, it, it got, for, what happened was, it got out of line. To, you know what it was, though? You know what it was out of line? The people that would show up to see the races, they go in the park a lot, and they think of all the parking spots, you know else can park there except them, to sit on the hoods of the car and watch us get off. And the girls, it, the girls, they were out of line. I, I hate to say it, the guys were more into the cars, and the girls were mostly into you know, the guys in the car. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so that's how that went. That's how it is, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, I served during Vietnam. United States Navy. Okay. okay. And I, I was picked out because of certain things I could do that a lot of sailors couldn't do. Like swim? <laughs> they didn't know how to swim. They had to, swim. They had to sit in the yeah. swimming class so you're out. And I swam. I said, man, this guy can swim. And you know what? Uh-huh. You know, I, I, I used to, when I was swimming, Flash Shacker is now a park. Fly shaker. Fly shaker pool? Yeah. It was a pool. I know. Before that. Okay, I swam in that pool. Okay, I swam in that pool. And I got regi- I got certified by the Red Cross as a swimming instructor. It means I could teach people to swim under the Red Cross That's programs. And I did. And I went, they sent me to Garfield Pool, which they tore down. Garfield, yeah. They well, tore it's, Gar- it's, it's up again. No, it's not. They tore it down. They rebuilt it? Yeah. They rebuilt it and they're renovating what? it again right now. Is it a pool? Yeah, it's a pool. Oh, really? Yeah, oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, I think you told me that. I didn't know that. Yep. It's wow. Up, it's up and running. Wow. Well, I think it might that be renovated mo- right now. But. Well, as long as you do. I didn't know what they, I saw when they tore it down, but then I didn't know what they were going to do with it. And they were talking about condos there. Okay. That's what they were saying. I don't know. Didn't happen. That's good. I was hoping that, where Jesus told me, just bring it back to where, where, where it was there for a reason. Yeah, to was. teach low-income kids how to swim. People need to know how to swim. Be safe in the water. Yeah. yeah. Not only that, but... It also teaches you to socialize with other people uh, yeah. and um, and oh, follow directions, so to speak. Right. And now, you know, uh, yes, yes. And I used, my class was my class was I got the, the crybabies, the ones that are scared of water. <gasps> I don't want to go in. I don't know why my mother dropped me out here. I don't want to go in the water. Oh shit! I said, look. You're not going to drown in a garbage. No, you, we don't use the D word. No, what we say do. is, you got to learn how to swim. <laughs> Putting a yeah, right. Yeah, that's it. Say something positive, right. Yeah. And the D word was not allowed. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, You're going to learn how to swim. Time. Stop complaining. You didn't do it out of that. So <laughs> I thought I missed something. You know, so they, what happened was... Did they learn how to I, swim, though? Did you teach them good? 
Man, you know what? Yeah. I, used to, yeah, I, I got bombarded I with all these crybabies. The parents didn't want to do with them on Saturdays. They wanted a day for themselves. Yeah. The weekend, they work all week. What are we going to do with the kids on the weekend? Let's just drop off a Garfield. Let them deal with them for a while until 4.30 in the afternoon. Yeah, that's a long day for you. Yeah, it was. I used to do two classes. I'd do a morning class, then I'd take a break, then I'd do the afternoon class. I did that for three years. I was certified, I was certified by the uh, certified water safety instructor. Yeah, it's good for you. That's a, that's a skill. And teaching it's a skill. Yeah. You know, just because yeah. you're a good swimmer. I mean, you, good even teacher. though you know how to swim, that doesn't mean you could teach somebody else how to do it. That's right. Yeah, you're right. No, really so anyway, what helped was I met I met somebody there. And she female was a, type? Female. Yeah. And she, <laughs> she was also a swimming instructor, like oh, me. Oh, okay. So we... So... Got something said, going on, huh? Well, I'll tell you how it happened. Yeah. My classes were big. I had 40 students. 40 people. Young kids. Scared of water. Oh. When are we going to go home? Yeah. She shows up. And they said, uh, said they told me to report to you. Then we're going to work together. We'll, all right, we'll split the class in half. You take 20, I take 20. Okay. Yeah, that's manageable. So we worked together. And all of a sudden, we started going out. Huh, I wonder how that happened. Mm -hmm. I know, teaching classes swimming? <laughs> yeah. I, I saw it in a one-piece bathing suit. I said, oh, my God, here we go. And that was a one-piece, huh? One-piece bathing suit. Not even a bikini. Well, no, you can't be an that instructor. wasn't allowed. Right. If you're an instructor, you can't be that. Yeah. No. They don't want to do exposure. Right. But, but the one-piece <laughs> right. one for me worked for me, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so she saw me. I had my red black bar. My lifeguard shorts went past my knee a little bit. Yeah, that could be pretty cute, though. Those it wasn't short. Shorts. No, it wasn't real short shorts. They were past my knee. Yeah, but still, you can tell. You can, you can see. I, 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 you know, you want to look into it. <laughs> yeah. You, but okay. the thing it is. That's a cute story. Like that, like that. That, that's one of my stories. Teaching kids how to swim. Yeah, and you know what? Your girlfriend. Is this, is yeah, that was sweet. sweet. She was sweet. Oh. Katrina. Katrina. Katrina Laskatov. Her parents were from Russia. Oh, wow. I know. I know. That's what I said. So you going to come meet my parents? Like, <laughs> not really. No, but I did anyway. Were they uh, nice? Yeah, I did. Okay. And they loved me. They... Uh, Hey, you want more than welcome? Come over and just have one. And you know, you, actually, if you want to, you guys just, if you want to spend a night, just spend a night in her room. Whoa. That's a, I <laughs> can't say no to that. <laughs> hey, I was shocked. I was shocked that her parents, so I didn't think, I thought they were all being, you know, the Russians. Yeah, all, really, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, he was a longshoreman by trade here. In the, he was a longshoreman. Oh, right on. Okay. So he was tough. You yeah. Know. I know some of those saying, guys. Oh my God! What, a, what the hell did I get into? And they were so nice to me. I couldn't believe it. I said, Wow. They must have liked it. We got. It was, you got some tons of rice. It. Hey, it was, yeah. What's up? You know what? I know you, you guys do. Together for a while now, your boyfriend, girlfriend, and so and so on. So what's gonna happen here? What are you gonna do? No. Oh, they already knew what's going on. But then her father said, "Come in the garage. Come in the garage. I got. I want you to see something." So I think, what the hell's in the garage that I need to see? And then we're gonna vodka. We're gonna go. Okay. 1959 Eldorado Cadillac. 
pearl white two door special and red in red leather interior oh. and the, the dash was all wood grain. I, I mean it was up the up. Whoa. And I said, Wow. No, 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 no. Yeah, my dad bought this brand new. He bought it brand new in 1959 and we still have it. It's still in the garage. I said, yeah. He said he said, you know what? I already asked my dad if we could sit in the back seat. And my dad, her father said, yeah, you guys can sit in the back seat by 59 yeah. Eldorado. Look at that. You got to take a picture and everything. You got to. And we didn't do it. We didn't do it. No evidence yeah, there. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh, That's a good story, though. Hi. Well, you want to hear, good, uh, you want to hear that story? That's a good one that was, there. That's a good story. Yeah. I named it. If I was going to do a book, that chapter, I was going to name it El Dorado.